hey everyone welcome to rata reading today we're going to be doing a very random pick a card reading there's no specific topic that i would like to do for today um i'm just going to be just uh channeling or reading uh, what i'm getting for you guys so i've pulled out four cards so uh selection one we have your frog selection two we have your cobra selection three we have your fox and the fourth we have your wolf so you can select based on the image or whichever animal that kind of attracting you right now so this can be any uh, random messages guys that you can get through today's reading so uh let us get started guys hey welcome room number one this is for whoever selected this uh frog card here so um with this particular card right away as it's quite difficult for me to pick this card up here and with this uh, image of this frog uh, I'm getting quite sad uh, as though you've been waiting for quite a while right now you've been tired of waiting perhaps uh, you're kind of waiting for some situation or certain things to come towards you or certain situation to end or something you are probably going through a very uh, difficult time definitely you probably feel as though there's something uh, on your back here that's kind of like uh, hovering on you like uh, like kind of disturbing your peace or uh, yes it's kind of impacting your self-esteem you're definitely pile number one and picking up here with the frog here probably you are wishing to escape like you want to flee from this current situation that you are dealing with that is definitely i'm picking up as though like the rain is not stopping the rain of sorrow the rain of miserable misery it's not stopping it's kind of like it's not stopping for you for some of you i am definitely picking up as to you like uh feeling as though you are walking uh around uh, each shell like you are being so careful like you do not want to add up more on the situation that you are in right now like like things are very difficult like things are really difficult and you just does not know how to do with it this can be even uh, talks about your uh mental your mind space probably you feel there is a lot of like voices like you are kind of in a in a very difficult situation here like you want to come out of a situation but it's like never ending story definitely it's a never ending story kind of uh, energy i'm picking up from you guys Find one so let us see what else that i'm picking up for you it's a random message here guys there's no specific definitely this is about you i'm picking up it's about you feeling about yourself here uh, there's some type of scar in your heart or somebody could have like caused some type of a scar wound that you are trying to like yeah, things are like you feel as though it's falling apart definitely because the cards are falling and or probably you are holding back so much within you that you want to speak out or you want to say out but you are not doing it you are keeping it and it's kind of disturbing your peace here definitely it's impacting your self-esteem here power one so let us see for power one a random message for you guys So definitely I am saying that you are very much indecisive. You kind of like really scared. You are afraid of some type of a situation here, some type of a seeing some type of a possibilities of your current situation this can be something related to your feeling here definitely i'm picking up you kind of like holding back really really you're holding back you just refuse to let go because you are afraid that it will impact you tremendously it can impact your stability here but what you don't see is that probably you might 
lost something that's very dear to you at this very moment by taking this leap of faith or by speaking from your heart but by speaking it you want to be walking into a new direction which is you're going to be finding your treasure island like you're going to be seeing uh, like you're going to be either meeting but i'm picking up the word meeting you're probably going to meet somebody that's going to be yeah definitely this is something pertaining to your your dream some type of an anchor some type of a stability here you're going to be like go going towards your dream here probably you could be a sagittarius here you could have a lot of dreams here some type of a vision that you have for you this can talks about traveling talks about a relationship at the moment you might be feeling as though you are in this quicksand if you're gonna make any type of movement here even if you want to flee from the situation you want to escape from the quicksand it's kind of like gonna be like pulling you even deeper that's what you are feeling so you are not making any move you just stagnant you just stand you are standing still you are either sitting still or just being still if just still because you do not want to make it worse but by doing that it's what's going to make it worse here definitely it's about some type of a new beginning here some type of a new beginning that you are afraid you are afraid about your like you are holding it so tight to you something which is you are definitely holding it tight to your heart let us see what is it all about here Balvon. let us see here what is it all about here okay we have here great fortune this can be a uh, connection here guys this can be a connection here or this can be a romantic connection this can be some type of a job or career uh, or some type of definitely i did this too that's what i'm picking up here that's kind of like you're holding back let us see why are you holding back like if you can say like you are worrying that this thing is going to leak it's going to fall down like you're going to be left out with nothing this could be something that you probably could have like put a lot of your sweat your time your effort your energy to work on this to make it happen so therefore this can be some type of a stability this can be a stability of a connection of your job of your money of your finance it can be anything I'm saying num angel number 544 for you guys. You probably might want to check 544. You will have an additional message there. I'm picking up 544. Let us see why are you holding back here. There's some type of a boundaries here. Some type of a condition here. Like you have been kind of like placed here. Like you can't see beyond... A certain limit here definitely you unable to see beyond certain limit here certain boundaries here like it's kind of haunting you definitely you probably having a lot of sleepless night because of this because of you can't uh, see beyond the current situation that you are in right now uh, pile one I'm definitely uh, get uh, hearing that you really have to dream big you either have to dream big or you have to think big like you have to think beyond the current perspective or the situation that you are in right now you are kind of stuck in some type of a container or some type of a wall within a wall here you you have placed there and you're not seeing beyond that you're not seeing there is a bigger world from what you have within this wall here you kind of like uh, going in a round here in, uh, in a circle here like you probably kind of like going uh, in a circle here you can't like in an in a, in a infinity way you're probably seeing a lot of infinity symbol here part one you really have to think right uh, or think big about thinking right here probably you feel as though you need to be in this uh, place wherever that you are in because that's what people could have like say to you that you have to be still in order for you to be right yeah it's about some type of a stability this can be a connection here a family matter 
this can be something which is 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 very fond, you are very fond towards this but not right now it could be something happened in the past something very fond to you but right now you're trying to have a deeper deeper look into this stuff like you are really diving deep to understand uh, why are you so fonded with this why are you like really holding it tight to you this is this is this is kind of for me i would say it's like an acceptance here you are kind of accepting your current situation and you are really starting to look deeper but it's it's like you have to even do you have to go even deeper than this like you just still in the surface level here like you in order for you to to meet your treasure here you have to like really understand why are you going through this why is it so hard for you to let go some type of a justice here some type of a balance required in the situation here definitely it's about your destiny here power one definitely is about your destiny it is impacting your self-esteem here probably you could be someone who is very good communicator but right now or, or you could be someone who could be a very great manifester in the past but right now you probably feel as though things are not moving things definitely not moving for you probably there's something that you have to see have to do have to decide some type of an action is definitely is required here and picking up a leo energy strongly a leo energy is like as though it's a time for you to act definitely it's a time for you to act here so let us see what else uh power one needed to know here we have about six of swords here you are trying to escape from a situation here in silent in silent probably you are dealing with a water sign here or you probably kind of keeping this emotion of moving away very very secretly here you do not want to reveal do not want to say out to anybody it's about decision of moving forward here yes towards your wish fulfillment here definitely it's about your wish fulfillment it's about your inner peace here there's something that is kind of disturbing your inner peace this is about a connection here this can be a some type of a long-term partnership here that's kind of like disturbing you this can be some type of a friend or some type of a partnership this can be a job uh, it's definitely it's about some type of a partnership that you are kind of in and it's kind of like really putting you in a very quick sand of kind of a situation here there's a lot of arguments like you are here in this situation you're still holding back as though you want to prove uh, your point or you're trying to prove something to yourself but what you don't see is that the more you're going to try to prove you are right it's going to be hurting you even more because it's not because let us see before i just let me just clarify here definitely because uh, what you kind of like like what you are trying to prove yourself right is something that it's a ten of pentacles it's, it's a legacy it's some type of a happy ending it's a beautiful relationship it's a beautiful commitment it's a beautiful stable commitment a house a bank balance inheritance something that it's long lasting some type of a divine blessing here that's what you are trying to kind of like not you're trying to not to see the truth here you kind of holding back you are trying to prove that you are in the right place this is not right this is not meant for you you're trying to push away but which is like supposed to be your divine blessing here let us see what will happen soon what will happen next what will happen next here i'm seeing a new uh, opportunity is arising for you guys it's an opportunity here so it's up to you whether do you want to take this opportunity or you are not it's up to you where i'm saying with the sun is shining bright here as though the divine has given you this opportunity this new opportunity for you to embrace but it's still up to you whether do you want to take it or not with this energy of a very young energy here this could be some type of a uh, effort that you have to take this could be some type of a effort that you have to start from a scratch here something that you have to start over but it's going to be so fulfilling here if you can see a lot of green here definitely it's gonna help to heal your heart chakra here group one 
Yes, I have the skin of cup, definitely. This can be some type of a connection here, guys. You have some type of a eye on towards somebody here. This can be some type of a wish fulfillment. This can be a person here that you really have an eye to that you want to move forward but you are kind of if you can see this person's face is like you are in a deep contemplation whether should you or can you take this step here but definitely i am seeing that you should because uh it's the sun is shining bright it's going to be a positive uh outcome for you because whatever that you are afraid right now you are thinking from the place of this wall here within these boundaries here which is a very limited belief it's a self-limiting belief here that's kind of stopping you group one that you really have to work to come out from here so let us see what will be the advice for you so let me just uh, pull out the advice for you group number one let us see here what will be the advice for you what you can do on this situation here what the universe really want you to do so for group number one here we have pure lightning it's for me it's kind of like it's like a glancing if you can see if i'm not sure if you can see through this card here there's an image here at the back here there's there's a body there's a person there's an image here so lightning is happening within you that you have to embrace it because it's opening up a portal for you especially at the heart here it's opening up it's a portal is opening up it's number three again it's a blue is some type of a communication it's about speaking the truth it's speaking about some type of a truth from your heart is to save yourself to open up this bottle the bottle is open is opening up if you can see it, like what i mentioned here the sun is uh, shining bright is kind of opening up for you this bottle is going to bring to you the stand of pentacles and this nine of cups this is wish fulfillment and a legacy which is long lasting everlasting for you definitely but it's something that you have to take an action here definitely you have to speak some type of a truth here it is required here it's gonna it, it might require it it also can talks about talk about bringing some type of light into a situation here like you have to bring some type of a light here like this bottle the moment that this bottle opens i'm saying that this darkness here is going to be disappear it's going to be disappear and it's going to you're going to be shine you're going to be uh, see you're going to be seeing this light this light here probably this is what you wanted this is what you are seeking for it's here group one so this is what i have for you for today guys uh please let me know if this resonates with you i'll see you in my next reading guys bye bye hey welcome group number two this is for whoever selected this cobra card here so let us see what will be the random message that you guys need to know I'm definitely picking up with this cobra card some type of a truth some type of a truth acceptance it is required from you like the divine the universe wants you to face some type of a truth here probably you are trying to distract yourself from seeing this truth here probably it's kind of like you are i'm feeling as though it's choking difficult to, to breathe like it's difficult to to think it's making you to feel restless definitely power two Probably you tired of seeking some type of a truth or some type of a answers or some type of truth is I'm definitely hearing some type of a truth or you are trying to hold to some type of a truth 
but let us see more and this is definitely some a very strong message we have here group two okay let us see here group two what will be the random message that you need to know for today With this all these three major arcana guys, definitely there is something major that you are going through right now. If you kind of feeling that things are not right, things are falling apart, that you are confused, you are in the zone, like you feel as though you are totally zoned out, you just doesn't know what to do, you are completely out. Probably you are in this isolation, like you probably you feel as though you have uh you probably could have stopped talking to a lot of people that you used to hang out or you could have uh, used to deal with because it's kind of overwhelming for you and i'm saying that you are kind of keep on manifesting for a lot of things in your life but it's a it's a constant disappointment here definitely i am picking up it's a constant disappointment constant stagnation is happening you've been in a deep contemplation a deep thought that why is it's not happening to you i'm saying triple one here definitely there's some type of a huge huge message is here for you guys it's about you need to take some type of action here you probably power one is similar to you but it's, this is quite major guys definitely this is something you have to take uh, charge of the situation here there probably some type of uh, situation happened here let us see what would be the situation that happened to you before i can advise you more it's about some type of uh, institution some type of uh, it can be your mindset this can be some type of conditioning or this can be some type of uh, institution this can be a family or you are in the place of calling a judgment here about to you are not sure you are holding back and you are walking away be probably about some type of a judgment that you could have taken in the past because you were in this uh, place of making a judgment here or probably uh, you could be feeling as though you could be a cause of some certain situation happened here in the past definitely this is a past energy here probably it's the past energy here you are in the energy of really thinking right now what to do This can be something pertaining to money. This can be pertaining to some type of a money or some type of a finance or stability here that you kind of hold back here, some type of a truth here. Like you was doing this poker face. Yes, exactly. That was the exact word that I was finding for just now. It's about being in the poker face here. Like there was some type of a truth. It was here, if you can see. The truth was here. It's kind of like you had that truth this is definitely is about some type of a truth some type of a situation some type of a truth the truth is there it's within you it's still within you is holding back it's kind of disturbing you you had it now the truth has become a poison i would say it's kind of like killing you within you within you this can be a guilt this can be a guilt this can be you or the person that you are dealing with it can go vice versa guys just take it whichever way that resonating with you but definitely it's about some type of a situation some type of a judgment was made here uh, but by someone being ignorant chose to be ignorant chose not to see chose not to make any decision of being this ignorant here being in the poker so that something was back of the deck we have nine of swords here definitely you are not you are in the energy of deep despair energy like you just doesn't know what to do you just doesn't know what to do probably either you or the person that you dealt with if you could see one of you could have taken away this 
one cup eight with one nine of cup either to you or to your person this can be some type of a wish fulfillment some type that some type of a fulfillment something that they really wanted so badly and i could see one of you could have taken out of this nine cup one of their wish fulfillment could have snatched away from them due to that they could have uh, one of them could have decided to move away from the situation here there was a like kind of like eclipse here some type of a truth was 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 kind of right like was hidden here it's still hidden i would say because we have a cobra here some type of a deep knowing here deep knowing which is still it's been like probably you are going through some type of uh, confrontation some type of uh, confrontation by these people we have two people here probably some type of a key information was given here some type of a uh, confrontation some type of a discussion some type of a facing some type of a reality because of your decision making here between two yes you made a choice here between two this can be two choices two people two options but let us see why we have here the full card for you is we have your queen of wands we have queen of pentacles exactly between these two people you had to choose you had the chance to liberate yourself from this situation here but let us see what you have done here is either you or the person here but i am kind of picking up whoever that watching chose this pal that this could be you that what that who's going through this you could be the one who made this judgment call here like you are really going through this kind of things are getting very overwhelming for you because of you made a wrong choice here definitely it's eight of swords here you are pretty stuck you are pretty stuck right now in your mind because of some type of a guilt some type of a shame a disappointment here probably you could have chose you could have chose the wrong person here you could have chose this queen of wands someone who is I would say in a low frequency here someone could be very manipulative could be very cunning could be someone who can play a mind game very well and this can be a queen of pentacles someone who could be very stable someone who's very wise someone who's very humble down to earth here probably with this rabbit here probably this person could have taken a leap of faith and could have walked away from the situation here this is what i'm picking up here Yes, you are in this energy of manifesting like I mentioned earlier for some type of a beginning here. But things are not moving. Definitely, I am picking up a lot of stagnation here. A lot of stagnation here. A lot of uh, hidden energy here, guys. A lot of hidden energy. But let us see the world card here. The world card kind of representing uh, karma. is representing the Saturn here. It's ruled by the Saturn here. You, you kind of aware the consequences here probably you thought that uh, you could escape from the situation here but you kind of like reaping the reward is either you or the person here like even right now like you can't uh, you are reaping the reward probably that could be the reason why you're pretty stuck right now things are not moving i am definitely picking up the archetype of the bardo from the wild unknown uh, archetype card like you are in this uh vacuum kind of space right now things are not moving even there's no air like there's no movement there's nothing's happening like you are not hearing anything as though it's like you are totally zoned out and you just doesn't know what to do it probably you thought that you could escape from certain situation here or this can be someone that you could have you are you could have dealt in the past here guys definitely but let us see with this something changed here some type of a fortune have changed here one person have rise above and one person have to fall apart here they hit the rock bottom here one of them one of them hit the rock bottom they are still hanging if you can see this person is kind of looking at the person above here and this person is kind of in their own don't uh wall they don't even look at this person this could be the queen of pentacles here 
definitely something yes this is something major here guys if you can see all major arcanas this is something life-changing for you definitely something major happened to you this is something is falling apart if you can see this could be something that you thought it could be very stable something that you thought it's going to be permanent this can be some type of a honor some type of recognition also could have just fall apart this can be a respect respect in a community it can be some type of a honor people honoring you it's kind of falling fall fallen apart i would say it's fallen apart because it, it, it has to be because of some type of a decision making here definitely yes some type of a hasty decision S some type of a hasty decision some type of a decision that you made from a from your impulsive being very impulsive here without thinking it's just you took out of like anger out of uh, anger out of like greed out of like uh, you just want to prove your your point you probably confused mixed signal mixed emotion it could be anything guys it just was very impulsive here definitely is impulsiveness is involved here but let us see what happened what was the cost what happened here due to your impulsiveness here guys let us see what happened here definitely some type of a message here you could have received some type of a message some type of a letter some type of an email this can be something very concerning for you because you are afraid if you can see this anvil is still the letter is still on probably you kind of aware what this message is all about but you are afraid to kind of acknowledge this i'm seeing angel number 11 33 you probably have an additional message there guys yes you could be someone which is a risk taker someone like you do take risk like a go-getter but you you do take a very calculative risk you take uh, count of all the possibilities before you make a choice make a decision here this could be something that you thought it's going to be something that profiting to you it's going to be something which is very uh, gain it's going to be help you help you to gain something but i think it could be backfiring it's either you or the person that you dealt with it's kind of backfired definitely some type of a secret here some type of a secret here happened this is taken very privately very confidentially some type of a secrets some type of a thing came to light here definitely so uh due to this let us see what happened to how to yes you are in this dark energy you are fragmented right now things are not happening you are going you are kind of like hitting the person is hitting the rock bottom i would say things are falling apart like it's it's you are surrounded with a lot of darkness here could be you or the person I just want to emphasize so many times i'm so sorry guys it can be you or the persons we have here it's kind of haunting you this memory is haunting you it's an unfinished business here definitely it's haunting you so let us see what you should do next here Look two you have to come out from the small mindset you have to acknowledge something if you can see this teacup is empty probably some type of things which is empty within you that you are trying to fulfill this with some type of a uh, gain some type of uh, anger some type of uh, winning victory some type of uh, you are trying to fulfill this empty cup not with a love not with a fulfillment but kind of like doing in a bad way you have to come out from this you need to rest your mind here your emotion here you have to be in touch with your emotion here definitely part two yes this is something pertaining to your community here people are looking at you people are watching you definitely you have to make things right here definitely some type of a truth you have the truth here again i'm saying some type of truth you have been shown the way here but you kind of like probably you are afraid due to some type of a status some type of a situation is kind of holding you back here let us see what 
the decision or what step that you need to take here probably you are in this complacent energy like you are in this comfort zone that you are just thinking of not wanting to make a move here like probably you just don't want to uh, like you wearing this glove as though you do not want to like what they call it you do just don't want to get your hand dirty for example but but uh, it's about your honor it's like someone is watching you if you can see the light is on you like you have to take an action here some type of a truth here yes The more longer you're gonna hold this truth is gonna be causing you a lot of pain pal too it's a lot of pain here it's some type of a pain that it's not gonna it's, it, it's gonna be changing into some type of a scar it's, it's gonna be there for driver guys you gonna be won't be able to remove this stain this scar from your life if you're gonna hold this truth for a very long period of time here definitely I'm saying yes you have to release it you have to find a way to release to find a peace a inner peace within you yes definitely again we have a hierophant card some type of for adversity conflict you could be very uncertain right now but you have to bring balance into the situation here definitely some type of a situation yes we have a justice card here you have to bring balance here in order for you to have this stability this celebration here guys to you have to make things right here that's the only way that's the only way out that's the only way out guys you have to do this so let us see what will be the best action on the advice for you guys how to the advice for you for how to okay we have the crow here the crow is the secret keeper the secret keeper you have to speak the truth the crow brings the secret bring the secret that people it's it's over the time it's wisdom you hold some type of a secret that you could have seen you could have heard you have that wisdom you have to speak it's gonna make you wiser you have to speak definitely the crow here you're probably seeing a lot of crow these days if you do it's kind of like the crow the spirit guides is kind of telling you that it's time it's time you have to speak if not you're gonna be like kind of like go you need you're gonna be hitting the rock bottom guys it's, it can be you or the person that you are dealing with you guys are going down here like you need to speak the truth so this is what i have for you group two i really hope this reading resonates with you Please let me know guys. I'll see you on my next reading guys. Goodbye. Hey, welcome group number 3. This is for whoever selected this box card here. So let us see what would be the random message that you guys need to know. I am definitely picking up uh, with this fox energy here. Some type of uh, satisfaction is kind of like a relief. Definitely. <sighs> this can be like really i could see some type of energy is changing because these other two parts is kind of heavy here but group three definitely there is some type of a satisfaction feeling like satisfactory some type of a relief like you finally like seeing things for what it does like some type of a clarity like you have this knowing that you kind of like it's about probably that you finally have discovered yourself you have seen your actual worth and you could have seen certain things like you have had that aha moment probably like you had that enlightenment yeah it's kind of uh, reminding me the enlightenment card that some type of a light just struck out of nowhere and you just had that and it's kind of like you know you know exactly where to say how to say with whom to say and exactly and you're just observing power three you are observing whatever is happening around you you are observing you are not saying anything you're just observing you are 
observing, you are analyzing. Probably in the past, you don't process the data, the information that comes to you that you captured. Probably right now, you are doing it. You kind of being vigilant. You are very attentive. You are very vigilant. You are observing. You are being observant right now. You are trying to pay attention so much to your surrounding, especially with whom you are sharing or with whom the kind of coming forward to interact with you. But let us see more. This is a very beautiful energy, guys. It's kind of like I'm really happy for you if you could have definitely. I've been picking up. You could have definitely done a lot of shadow work here, a lot of like healing here. Definitely, it's kind of like you are coming to your own self here because this is a lot of yellow. Probably, uh, in the past, uh, if you can see a lot of uh, dotted, uh, a lot of likes, like probably people's uh, criticism people's validation people's uh, the way how people see you is kind of like impacted you a lot you probably give a lot of thoughts your time your energy thinking about what others think about you what how others sees you probably right now you kind of like have come out from this energy like you finally have known the truth here like you have known your worth you have known yourself probably the self that you could have like lost or probably you could have like lost contact here some type of a justice here definitely some type of a right you meet a wrong right here like you meet something right here for yourself we have a ten of pentacles like some type of a yes it's a grand stability it's a great stability that you have gained here this can be also talks about some type of a choices here. This is definitely you have put in a lot of work. Definitely a lot of work. You have been patient with yourself. You have let go a lot of addiction here. A lot of your uh, temptations. A lot of your mindset. A lot of things that you have let go. You probably been very calculative. You probably been very logical kind of like uh, very analytical probably you was kind of like playing a lot of mind game with others like maybe just for your gain or people could have do that to you and probably you was like doesn't know how to have a healthy boundaries with others so right now i'm saying that you are you have brought I would say you have already brought some type of a balance here to an extent here definitely you have kind of face or uh, kind of face a lot of uh, things that you kind of put in a back burner here like your shadow work you could have done a lot of shadow work in that kind of preventing you from moving forward from following to your uh, towards your passion you towards your destiny i'm seeing that you finally have come out from the energy of left out in the cold here probably you feel as though you need to defend yourself you have to be very defensive you have to like fight against the whole world because people kind of coming and snatching things from you people being like draining things draining energies there's no equal give and take from others uh, people always have some type of uh, agenda around you so i'm seeing that you finally have put a lot of effort here for this you you have spent a lot of time in a, in a, in a hermit energy like you have done a, a lot of self-reflection here a very beautiful energy group to a group tree yes it's a new beginning here definitely this new beginning this is what you kind of observing right now not because you are skeptical but you just want to alchemize whatever you have learned the wisdom that you have learned you do not want to just let it go you want to hold tight to the wisdom that you have gained and you are trying to use it you are trying to create the stand of pentacles here or you want to make it forever for you so you are kind of using it definitely in the past i'm saying that you probably was trying to juggle it's a lot of imbalance happened to you in the past this can be imbalance or not equal give and take with the people around you yes probably people was just trying to gain something from you people was trying to steal people was uh, playing their game people was lying 
right now i'm saying that you no longer uh, investing your energy dealing with this kind of people anymore you have moved away from this people as to like uh, you kind of like relabel yourself probably in the past because of you have gained give gave so much of your energy to the people that have done done wrong to you it's kind of like you was uh, defining yourself as a disappointment right now you are taking yourself out of that that you are no longer the disappointments you are no longer the failure here you are not uh, labeled by that it's about how you perceive yourself definitely you have changed that you need to be proud of you group 3 this is something major that you have done to yourself here that you brought this enlightenment to yourself here yes probably in the past you was very much like blindfolded here like you was very defensive you kind of like holding back a lot of things here because you were scared you were scared that people are gonna isolate you people are gonna hate you you was not moving towards your destiny towards something that you really want to do because it's it's kind of like toxic people around you a lot of toxic dynamic around you so uh, let us see here let us see more definitely these people are not good if you could, if you have cut disconnected from a lot of people i would say you have made a right choice here definitely these people are not good for you yes right now i'm saying that you are focusing only on yourself here from this seven of pentacles you are slowly moving to this eight of pentacles your energy is kind of like you wanting this ten of pentacles here you are working towards your ten of pentacles here probably you are working very hard probably this in the past people kind of like taking name for your success for your hard work people kind of like uh, overstep your boundaries people kind of uh, downcast you in some way i'm saying that you right now you just kind of being in this energy of you are deaf like you are not listening to anybody's like people could be bickering around you people could be like talking anything you just not listening you just moving forward it's just movement forward i'm picking up yes you are in this energy of like childlike towards this ace of pentacles here definitely towards your nine of pentacles to yourself independent here to be independent here you want to be financially independent you don't want to uh, rely depend on anyone you do not want to share like in a way that because you know people around you kind of just want to exploit your situation or just want to seize your opportunity here you are in this energy of a page of cup you are excited about life again you are enthusiastic right now you are excited and you are doing something with with wholeheartedly here and at the same time you are being observant here you're observant in a way that what you're communicating you're sharing to people around you you are trying to be very vigilant here definitely part three so what else that you need to know here you need to know that you really have to keep things to your heart like what you are doing right now yes indeed that's the right step you have to keep your secrets your success your your victories to yourself any type of uh, steps or uh, things that you you plans that you have for yourself you have to keep with yourself do not share even how close it is until you see that it came uh, it comes into fruition still then try to keep within yourself try to stabilize the plan the steps that you are planning to take for yourself here because I am seeing a lot of people will try to come and uh, enter, try to trespass your trespass your boundaries here. Try to be strong. Try to put your boundaries stronger. There are a lot of people trying to come. Yeah, they are they are in this despair energy. Probably you could have pulled back your energy from a lot of people here. They are in this energy of despair despair right now. Probably you are a very loyal person, pal three they just doesn't know probably they are in the despair energy because you have pulled back your energy probably they've been like feeding on your energy probably you was giving them a lot of energy right now you are have gained back your energy so just remember at one point of time uh, part three you was in this energy because of you with full consciousness you have pulled back 
they are in this energy so do not fall back do not share your success do not share your next step to anyone here yes you have to be this mean male here take charge of your life do not listen to anyone you always remember that this is your life you have the free will you have this is your unique uh, journey here regardless uh, you made a mistake you will make a mistake uh, it's regardless it's going to be your legacy you have to do it you should not uh, depend on anybody's validation here so let us see what else that you guys need to know here yes we have the dream here i'm seeing a lot of people kind of missing your energy a lot of people this can be your loved one uh, people who used to hang out with you people who used to be around your energy they kind of missing your energy definitely probably you could be feeling about that you probably could sense it you probably feel as though um, t from time to time you probably feel a bit down upset disappointed this could be because you are still energetically connected to them you have to kind of be strong here i would say Paltry, you have to be very strong here. Yes, you have to be balanced here with this friendliness card here. With number two, I'm picking up. You have to be strong here. You have to move forward because the person, the people that you have left behind, is kind of being a great burden for you. Definitely, because there are a lot of people. These are the people who are very jealous, very envious of your success here. I'm seeing angel number thirteen and fifteen. One three, one three. You probably might want to check angel number 1313 here guys uh, i'm saying yes they are very envious of you envious of your energy because you could you are giving a lot of beautiful energy here guys very subtle very very warm very nurturing very loving it's unconditional love energy without any expectation you always there for them you always answer their call you always will be there you always open the door for them like whenever they need something you always give your shoulder to them so it's kind of like you always give them your ears to listen to their problems their concerns probably at the moment that you have like drawn uh, back your energy they are kind of like lost right now so you need to remember to have a healthy boundaries and to keep yourself balanced here, part 3. So let us see what will be the advice for you here. The advice for part 3. We have here stand still. With this stand still, what I'm saying is that stand still with your decision here. You are walking through a new portal here, a new doorway, a new magical doorway that's opening up a lot of great new beginning for you. This is something magical moment for you. Probably there's going to be a little bit of turbulence for you because this is something like an energetical upgrade for you, something that is new for you. Probably you are shifting a lot of things within you, around you, something which is you're not used to this can be a uh, increase in your frequency you are ascending some some type of a turbulence i would say so just try to hold to it be still uh, do not fall back at the same time uh, hold tight to the boundaries that you have do not let anybody to step or overstep your boundaries here definitely that's what i'm picking up for paltry this is a very beautiful energy guys i really really happy for you because you have made it right you've made the right choice and i send you a lot of love and light guys i uh, just continue your journey here i just pray that you will be reaching your destination towards your destiny call guys till then i'll see you on my next reading guys bye bye hey welcome pile number four this is for whoever selected this wolf card here so let us see what we have for you for today with this wolf card here i'm picking up as though you are confused i would definitely see that you are in this transition or you are in the midst of making a choice here between 
the shadow side and the light side within you that you are confused this is definitely is about you i'm saying that you have this eagerness to make a decision here you want to make a decision here like if you can see this this kind of like really the year of this wolf here one is like really so attentive of like moving forward and the other one as though they are is kind of like listening to other people the surrounding here like you are kind of like wanting to take a decision by yourself like you 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 believe you do trust the other part you kind of being still paying attention to your surroundings and you are wondering why the best part what i'm seeing that you are wondering why even you are asking yourself why why are you still kind of paying attention to the surrounding here that's kind of like you know they are not right or it's not the authentic truth uh, there's something is kind of like bothering you like sometimes i'm feeling like this darkness is overshading this light sometimes it's kind of like this light is overshading the darkness here could be you are in this like in this in between here in between two walls here five four you are definitely in a mixed emotion here but let us see more the reason why you are in this mixed emotion here i'm seeing a knight of wands here I'm seeing a ten of wands here, so much of passion here, and ten of swords. Ten of swords. Here. And back of the deck, we have ace of swords here. You have, you wanting to move forward, <laughs> if you can see, but something is still holding you back. But you are tired. You have the truth here guys you have the truth this is your trump card i would say this is the truth this is the truth this is the divine truth this is some type of a realization this is something that you have to hold tight although you you have to differentiate this is your call if you think that uh, you want the universe to make a decision here you want the god to make a decision here you want the divine to make a decision here this is the divine decision here this is their action here the truth the truth has been spoken here has been revealed to you has been released to you has been shown to you presented to you has been handed over to you like the universe have proved probably you have been questioning all the while that uh, what is the truth or uh, what is the situation is all about or what is that thing that you are seeking for here it can be something pertaining to a courage here to make a decision here probably you want some type of a clarity here A situation here probably it's been running in your mind over and over again I don't know why I I'm picking up probably you could have chose pile two some of you so this is the decision guys this is the ultimate truth the utmost truth that you are seeking utmost uh, clarity or representation of the divine's blessing the divine's way of proving that they do exist they are helping you they are meeting you halfway here they are doing this up front for you probably for others the equation goes whereby you have to put in you have to meet the universe halfway and the universe will do the rest but in your case pal for i'm saying the universe have presented to you because you always question and right now has been presented to you on the table but 
you aware and you want to move forward but something is holding you back but let us see in specific here what is kind of holding you back here what is the stand of wands that's holding you back powerful that you are adamant of carrying it some type of a decision some type of a decision about a new beginning here again if you can see it's a divine blessing here it's a new beginning here but you are not doing it you are willing to be wounded here this can be you are mentally wounded here physically wounded here you are willing to put a great fight just not to accept or just to stand wherever you are you kind of like stepping on your own self-confidence here like you don't trust your own uh assessment your own review your own evaluation of the situation here even though the something has been presented to you i wouldn't say a truth some type of a clarity it can be some type of a situation some type of a answer that you always wanted that you always waited you've been waiting for this the sheep has arrived but again or you still refusing to make a decision here to a point that i am picking up as to the divine is kind of getting like disappointed of you holding back let us see what is the stand ten of swords for you powerful ten of swords here of thoughts yes definitely you are stalking you are stalking you are searching you are doing something online here you are searching you are seeing you are definitely keeping a tap here you are keeping it hidden here you are doing it very quietly back of that we have four of pentacles you are being very defensive you are keeping it near to your heart you do not want to tell to anyone something that you are doing online here power four so let us see what else that power four need to know here needed to know here Yes. be this mature man you have gone through you have done this before you have gone through a lot of life experience a lot of you have gained a lot of wisdom you know exactly what to do if you can see the light has lit up like you know exactly what to do use your wisdom here again we have the lover card here definitely probably you could be gemini or you could be dealing with a gemini here to bring peace into the situation here to make the right choice here to choose right change or sagittarius here or a leo Leo, Gemini, Sagittarius here. It's about some type of expectation here. You've been holding to it so strongly. You have to make the change here. It's only you can make the change here. Powerful. Nobody else. This is what the car is here. This car, this movement, this mobility. This communication, way of communication is here. Again, I'm seeing light. Light. What with light? So let us see what will happen if you take the decision right. You can think of a question right uh, think of a decision right now power four that you really want thing to take on this situation probably you know the best and you can think of a decision here 
or whether do you want to move forward or do you want to still hold on to it let us see if you're gonna hold to it it's gonna cause a lot of pain here a lot of mental stress a lot of exhaustion a lot of you're gonna be so tired you're gonna be devastated here i would say by the way you're gonna be this devastated person suppressing all your emotion all your passion all your own self-esteem here because you was refusing to let go some type of a condition here if you think this is you if this can be something pretending to your pride your ego if you think this is something about your pride your ego this is definitely it's not going to help you it's not going to fulfill you it's going to make you feel tired disappointed of your own self here it's going to cause a lot of chaos here moving forward for you guys yes it's going to be a lot of imbalance here a lot of imbalance within you guys so let us see what will be the best Thing that you can do or what will come forward very soon in your situation here guys i would see you because we have a seven of swords just now again a seven of wands just now again we have a seven of wands again lot of seven this is divinely orchestrated event here you probably need to move forward here guys you really have to move forward here this is something pretending to your passion you are passionate about this you are definitely more than passionate about this thing that you are dealing with yes it's a movement forward you have to make the decision now it's about now decide number seven again it can be seven. Seven could be very significant for you guys, or it can be the month of July. Yes, we have a ten of swans again. So much of synchronicities for you. This is something which is divinely guided here. And we have knight of wands. You have to we have knight of wands again. Great. You have to move forward here, guys. The divine wants you to move forward, to go for it probably you are hearing a lot of the word dragon or probably you could be seeing a lot of dragon's image something about dragon if do then i am seeing that uh, your animal spirit the dragon is trying to guide you to take this decision here so let us see what would be the advice for power for here have the weakness card here you have witnessed the magic here you have witnessed the truth you have witnessed the divine game here you have witnessed the divine power here you have witnessed the thing that you have been seeking for you have seen the magnitude of the issue of the situation that you are in right now you have seen the magic the behind it so you have witnessed it witnessed it in front of you Probably you felt it deep within you. So it's no more about questioning. It's about you making the choice here. It's about the choices here. Power 4. So this is what I have for you. I really hope that I could give you some insight that you are looking for. Please let me know guys. I will see you on my next reading guys. Bye-bye.